So about <clears throat> three weeks, maybe even a month ago, Kenzie's friend texted her asking if we wanted a cat because this friend had a friend, had a friend through multiple connections that was giving away a cat. And so now we have this little monster. This is Lucy. Her full name is Lucy Goose. Um, we were originally gonna name her Goose. Um, she didn't really respond to it though, but she responded immediately to Lucy. So she picked her own name. Aw, I hear that purring. This is her pillow, by the way. Her, she has a full body pillow and it's her favorite place to lay. Her second favorite place to lay is right in that little corner behind my desk or on my back. <laughs> so these, uh, these people that were giving her away, they were a couple and the, uh, the boyfriend really wanted to keep her because he got really attached to her. Understandably so, she is very, very sweet. She just gets a little skittish sometimes because she's still just a kitten. She's, uh, we got her when she was four months old. She's probably five months old now. Why are you eating your pillow? Is it tasty? Are you just picking out the remnants of catnip that's in there? But yeah, this they were a couple and the boyfriend really wanted to keep her because they got really, really attached. But the girlfriend did not want her at all. And apparently, they were just gonna let her free at a park. And so me and Kenzie said, absolutely not. That is not happening. And so now she lives here with us. And sweet little baby. We love her so much. You're really going ham on eating your pillow. But you're purring, so I'm not gonna question it too much. Uh, like the second week that we got her, we did a, uh, a PetSmart run to get her all these toys. We got her this little hut. This is her slapping box. She likes to hide in that box. Whenever someone walks past, she slaps the shit out of them. We got her this little toy. She Her favorite time to play with that is at three in the morning when we're all asleep. And we got her this, this little collar. It has a little bow on it. It was really cute. And she looks really cute with it on. But she hates it, so we don't for we're not we don't force her to wear it. Um, we'll we'll probably try putting it back on her. Just drop something on myself. I'm probably gonna try to make her wear it at some point, just in case she does get out. We'd like to, so she has a that has the our phone numbers on it, so we can get her back. He's mostly good. She's the brat. <laughs> Hi, baby. Where are you going? This dude's name is George. This is my roommate's cat. Very sweet boy.
This is her space. We need to get out. Lucy, be nice. Hey. Hey. No hissing. Georgie, back up. No hissing. Okay. Be nice. I know he was trying to eat your food. That's why I moved it. Are we okay now? Are we okay? High five. Ma'am. She's being a little brat right now. Ugh. We're trying to give them a little bit of exposure every day. Gradually try to get them used to each other. For the most part, she kind of stays in our room. I'd like to get to the point where she can just wander about the house on her own, though. Can't leave her unsupervised right now. Why are you staring at me? Got a problem? What's your smell, girl? What's up? I mean, that seems to be what's happening right now. Lucy. Exploded. Oop. I can't uh, hear stuff anymore. And then I went in, they were like, you have above average hearing. And I was like, George. Oh. They got into a fight. So now she's just chilling. Oh, I woke her up. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry, honey. Just go back to sleep. It's okay. Come on, honey. Oh, she's being sweet. Oh, sweet baby. Hi, honey. We have no real idea what kind of cat she is. We suspect that she is at least part Maine Coon. I don't even know if that's how you pronounce it. <laughs> but we, we think that because she has little like fur sticking out of her toes, and that's pretty common among them, and she's very, very fluffy. She, she looks a lot bigger than she actually is. It's mostly fluff. She's actually very, very tiny. But we are suspecting that in a couple of years, she's gonna be huge. And I'm so ready to have a little fluff ball just running around everywhere. She's being such a sweet little girl. Oh, hi. Hi, honey. Oh, I hear that purr. If you bite me, we're gonna have a problem. Okay. No bites? Good girl. Uh, the first day that we got her, she uh, they brought her in a crate. She hates car rides, so she was already pretty skittish. And being around new people, she got kind of scared. And uh, especially being in a new location, that freaked her out the most, I think. So like the first day and a half, she was mostly kind of just hiding under her bed, under our bed. But she, she would come out and she would eat her food. She'd use her litter box and she was already perfectly trained since getting her. I haven't stopped pulling fur out of my mouth though. But she got really, really comfortable really fast. Uh, we, we tried to keep her out from under the bed for a while, but now we, um, if she wants to go under the bed now, she can just because uh, it gives her a nice little safe hiding spot in case she feels overwhelmed or whatever. But she's very much a window kitty. She loves to sit on the windowsill and just watch the cars drive by. Don't you, girl? You like sitting at the window, baby? She, uh, she sometimes likes to be held uh, like, like a little baby, but uh, she, she lets us know when she's had enough. She's uh, she kind of like, like swats at us. She never uses her claws though. Whenever she swats at us, it's always just the pads of her feet. She's always very, very gentle. And, uh, she like, she like play nips. She, she bites a little bit, but it's not like, it's more of just like a, just, just a little play bite. More of just like, hey, I have teeth and I will use them if I have to. That's, we basically just get a warning. See that little tail just flicking around? The, uh, the chair I'm sitting in, though, this is another one of her favorite spots to lay whenever I'm not sitting in here. She likes to just lay right there. And so I, uh, I try to, like, scoop her up and move her, but uh, she starts slapping at me because, no, it's her chair now. She's claimed it. But, yeah, we've had her for about a month now, and she's amazing. We love having her. We're just trying to get the two kitties to get along. But I think what happens is she tries to play or she gets kind of scared because George is a bigger cat. He's a beast um, and she's so tiny, but she's feisty and she likes to jump and she plays kind of rough. But other than that, she's doing really, really well. And I'm very happy to have her. She's so sweet. Since we got her, I do feel like she's gotten so big already. Hi, honey. High five. Ow. Those were your claws. 
I kind of asked for that one though, didn't I? He's such a little cute fluffball. <laughs> we only really have like one toy for her. It's like, it's like a little, oh, 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 she's coming for me. I told you this is her slapping box. Here it is.